Hello Blast Processors and another unboxing video. The title's given it already, already that's what, what we're doing. Um, and it's something old and something new. It's not borrowed, but it's definitely blue. As you can see, it's the C64 Mini, which exactly what it says on the tin, or box in this instance, is a Commodore 64 emulated in a small box, really. Um, it's very nice. On the outside, it's a quite nice box. It's got a spot of varnish for the logo and the picture. As you see, it looks very Commodore-ish with the blue and white colour scheme. So, give you a quick guide, there's what you get. Um, the detail on the end, some different features list on that side, logos, top, a detailed breakdown of the actual contents and what games you get on the back. And it's got a bit of weight to it. So anyway, the box comes sealed, was those round sticky things both ends. So, never fear, in we go. Right, open the flaps and I'm seeing another box. Which kind of makes sense because it feels quite sturdy. So which way up is the open part? Ah. Ah. Take that away. We now got another box, a very blue box with the logo in the front. So, so far, nice impressions. Well packaged. Right, this is one of those where you open on the side. So, so we open the lid. Oh, and here we got them. Actual new 64, mini 64, and throw it next to it. Um, hand clear plastic trays. I'll just lift it up so you can see it. And hopefully, the light doesn't get in the way. Okay. So, first things first, what should we go with? Well, obviously, let's go with the, the, console, the console. The new Commodore 64 mini. Right, oh, that came off easy. Um, Da, da, da. There we go. There he is. Though I must admit, I don't remember it being that particular shade. It was more of a grey. Well, mine was more of a grey. Uh, obviously, the keyboard isn't real. Um, that was quite nice, quite effective. You do know this is actually a proper computer. You can program it, but you have to plug in your own USB keyboard. Let's make that clear at the start. Power light, fictitious front keys, and spacebar. Right. Um, it's got a division line around the side, like you remember. HDMI, oh, make it easy for you. HDMI and power in, looks like a mini USB to me. And on the side, we have two standard USBs. So you can plug in a keyboard, the joystick, or two joysticks. Right, so that's, that's all right. That, that feels quite nice. Yeah, it's got rubber feet, which I think of hiding the screws. So let's put that down. Uh, there will be a moment. Well, this is interesting. That's the cover for that. And the cable goes behind the cable packaging. Oh, more goodies. Right. Okay. Joystick and charging lead. Dun, dun, dun. Buttons, they feel like micro switches. There's not much movement in the stick, but that's probably how it used to be. I'm trying to remember. There's some extra buttons on the top here and on the sides. All right, so joystick. Let's make more space. Okay. We're using the smallest table in the world, folks. There's a few things that fit in here. And we've got, oh, HDMI lead. And a manual. All right. Get that out and create some space. We've got the C64 Mini. We have the power lead. HDMI lead. And the joystick. And there's also a quick guide, which kind of helps. As you can see, it's in the standard blue and white. You remember from the old Commodore days with the stripy pattern. Though I don't see a chicken head symbol anywhere. Um, and as you would expect inside, it's a manual, multilingual, English, French, Italian, Dutch, Spanish, something like that. The instructions, well, we'll come back to that sort of the day. So there you have it. Now remember, this 
well that comes with games pre-installed you can add your own games we should hopefully do a video of that in the future once we figure it out ourselves um, and it's also programmable so you can program it well, obviously plugging in a USB keyboard makes it easier and if you use a USB splitter you can get the keyboard and joysticks and things all work together I've seen people doing that already so quite nice well I hope you enjoyed that please like and subscribe and bye for now